Hello guys, I am Alex. Today I'm gonna show you here the communication between Python, Micrologix and Microsoft Excel. So I'm creating my daily report. So I'm gonna share with you, I'm gonna show you here the script that I created here from Python and, and something about my daily report. So let's take a look on my daily report here. So I'm gonna open it up here, the folder. So like you can see here, every single day, um at 8 21 pm so i'm creating my daily report and the daily report that i have i have here right now uh i just stopped it in this day here but i have let me open it up here and like we can see over here okay so here we have my day report and basically we have the motor here we have the status if it is true or false if it is running or not running and also we have like my uh, instrumentation here my lyt the trans uh, tr level transmitter and we have the value here and here it five seconds i mean logging data here on the spreadsheet so this is like my database on Excel and I'm creating from Python library so let me share with you how can I do how I did this so I'm gonna not don't save right now and let me open my Visual Studio here uh, Visual Studio code so first thing here I have like my um, library we have one library that says uh, is, uh, this is called it like Python uh, PyCom3 and I import SLC driver so the SLC driver works with Micrologic and the SLC 500 so I put like date and time because I can I can decide each time I can uh, log data and I can save here so what I'm doing here right now is I'm using shuttle 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 is the library that we gonna like copy and paste this in another place if you gonna work with let's say one file and you need cop and paste in another in another place on your pc so you're gonna use shuttle here all right so um what am i doing here i mean i'm doing like a def i mean def, um, def main here so on def main we have i need open let's say or close this if i have opened it one spreadsheet at the beginning of that I, I i will make sure that i have um open open this guy here this is la, that i'm gonna create like uh every single day and after that i'm gonna do like this so this is the file path so with workbook i'm gonna create a, no, a new workbook and here what i'm gonna do here is um i'm gonna do like this name she here um, the readers motor status nivel um value or valor um timer so this name here i i made let me open here again so we can see here motor status nivel valor um timer so this reader here is based on what I, I put over here. So this is the readers. Um, this is gonna append readers. And this is the loop to write on Microsoft Excel. So while true, so I'm reading from, from the, the PLC side. I'm online with this PLC right now. So this is the tag that I'm gonna read. And after that, I'm gonna each single um, line or new uh, location I gonna put plus one that means every single log I gonna put in the new rank new rank so this is that I'm doing right now so let's say um, each single value I gonna put in the new new um, let, let me put over here so this is the last last rank so if I gonna put the let the, the next value here let's say so I gonna put it on the next next um, column or line that is available so in this case gonna be this so each one 
so this is that what it means here that like this this plus one here this is the row the next row available so and after that i'm gonna put the time here so the uh, date time and what i'm doing here is on the column one so column one gonna be the motor and i'm gonna take just the part of the data i'm gonna take the part zero this is the motor here so the motor is the description so i i mean I'm, I'm taking the description here so this is the column one column two column three column four column five okay we have four or five column here uh let me go up so and we have five five column and like you can see column one column two column two is just the the value uh column three column four column five the date and time so i'm putting the date and time each time that i'm gonna log data here i need to see when i put the data on the spreadsheet so this is the reason that i'm putting like date and time this is true important because this totally makes sense for us when we're gonna do uh like we're gonna see when the motor uh turn off or turn on so i can put over here we can see or we can um uh figure it out when the motor uh, was off when comes up or uh, comes on something like that so and after that we have these guys over here and like i said i mean i mean copying this so after like 2021 20, every single day what i'm doing here is i'm copying this uh file here and paste in another folder that is, is called like daily report okay and i'm rename each uh each daily report with date and time on that so you can see here that i have this and we have the date and time that the the was created this daily report over here so we have daily report here micrologic python daily report folder and here we can see that we are doing this exactly this here so and we have like 60 seconds to start again the new report every single day so this is that i did here um i hope you enjoy a lot what i did and you can take an idea to do what you want to do in your side and see you next video bye